What's up YouTube, this is the R World Gamer, and a few hours ago the Cicero Crisis event ended and they sent out our rewards. So what I want to do today is give you a quick overview of what we got and give you a first look build guide for the Wraith Twin Vipers. Once you've logged in, check your inbox. You should have a letter from the Lotus detailing all the rewards you got for your hard work picking flowers. If you were able to get 10 points from the event, then you would have received the event badge. And if you got 50 points for the event, you would receive a set of four dual stat mods, one for each weapon. At that max rank, these mods give 60% extra poison damage and 60% status chance. If you followed my first video, then you maxed out the event, you should have received your Wraith Twin Vipers. Looking at the weapons side by side, it's easy to see that the Wraith Vipers are a nice upgrade. They've got higher impact damage, making them a good choice for corpus enemies. Along with that, they've got a higher crit chance and damage, increased status chance, a larger magazine, and the Wraith have a larger base damage. And to top it all off, it comes with a catalyst and a dash polarity, making the work to max this weapon out that much easier. For this first build, I've used some common mods that most everyone should have. Use a horn strike and take it all the way up if you can. Second, this weapon has great crit chance, so use a pistol gambit. It should bring it up to about 35%. Use a target cracker to increase the crit damage. And since it's such a good corpus weapon, use your expel corpus. And to complement your expel mod, use a convulsion and a deep freeze for magnetic damage. For the advanced build, I'm going to keep the Hornet Strike. Again, take it all the way up if you can. I'm going to add a Barrel Diffusion and a Lethal Torrent. This is going to give you a 100% chance to fire an extra round and about an 80% chance to fire three rounds. Even though this weapon has a larger magazine than its predecessor, it still empties the clip faster than you know what to do with. So an enemy mutation mod is going to help you out a lot here. For my elemental combinations, I'm going to use Radiation for Grenier and Magnetic for Corpus. So this is it for the first look at the Wraith Twin Vipers. A little disappointed that it only has a max capacity of 210 rounds, but overall I think this is still a good weapon and worth having. Thanks for watching. Please remember to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll be back. More Warframe.